So this is the flash drive which needs to be inserted into the USB hub. There you go, the USB has been detected, rather the flash drive has been detected. Now heading towards the refus file, I am using the older version, I am selecting the flash drive and selecting the bootable android OS, here it is bliss OS and I am selecting the GPT partition and pretty much straightforward. I am fast forwarding this video uh, as soon as the video gets completed uh, we need to reboot uh, the system because uh, the bootable flash drive won't get detected in the system that's why a uh, single reboot is required so rebooting this Windows system now we'll go into the setting and update in security in the recovery and then we'll restart this device We'll select a device, Linpus Lite. Now we'll move to the Bliss OS installation. As you can see on the screen, now it's loading all the files present in the bootable flash drive. I'm selecting the drive which I have formatted it. The 6 GB drive I have formatted with ext4 extension 4. I'll format it with the ext4 and uh, that's it selecting the bliss os and fast forwarding this video again now Good logo has been seen here. Let's see how it works. It's working fine, no problem here. Uh, I found an issue with this. Uh, the volume button is working perfectly. As you can see, volume down is working perfectly volume up is also working perfectly flawlessly there is no issue with it but uh, when i try to press the power button it shows power menu instead of uh, the screen going off and there's some bug here look at this power menu pops up as soon as i press the power button power menu pops up there's a bug here this needs to be fixed uh, I, I think uh, it would get uh, fixed in uh, upcoming version of uh, the bliss os hope so so i found out a way by double tapping on the status bar the screen goes off so this is the way and uh, when i press the power button again as you can see here in this video when i press the power button um, it takes uh, three four seconds to boot up or rather to show up the screen then it start working fine so a little bit of bug here and there which can be fixed by the developers Thanks for watching this video.